welcome back dreamers to dreamlight valley decor youtube channel thank you guys so much for thumbsing up this video and subscribing i appreciate it more than you know so today i am sharing my plaza fall festival build and i will not be talking throughout this entire thing it's actually gonna be music i'll be back towards the end because this is the longest build i ever created and it would be a whole lot of talking so um, I hope you guys enjoy I share every part that I possibly can of this build even things that I don't end up um, end up liking uh, because I want you guys to see my thought process through it and see that I try a bunch of different things sometimes before I get what I like so you guys can see that sometimes it doesn't always work out the way that I want it to and so you guys can hopefully get into my mind and see what I'm trying to figure out and what I'm trying to go for and how you two can create these amazing builds just like I do is just trial and error and playing with things and seeing how you like it so I hope you guys enjoy this build please let me know your favorite part in the comments and I will see you guys at the end of this
hope you guys enjoyed the speed build. Here is the walkthrough. So I absolutely love that the um, brick pillars that we secretly found can you can put things on them i love that i wish i could put a pumpkin because that's what originally what i was going for i wanted to put a pumpkin on it but the pumpkins are too big and they take up too much space and um so i couldn't do that even though that's what i wanted to but i hope you guys enjoyed it i love how i put so many pumpkins and different kinds of pumpkins i love that there's so many different kinds of pumpkins there's pumpkins from the halloween event there's pumpkins from um cinderella there's just a bunch of pumpkins so it really gives it the vibe that i was going for i love that i was able to also use the fireflies i love that i created this little train area because if you go to fall festivals you know that there is a kids section and so i had to create a kids section for the fall festival here and i thought it was so cute to add little toy story toys monster ink stuff the animals a little picture booth over there that you can see <laughs> and so i added some of the toy story stuff also added the train and i think that the train went so perfectly with this fall festival setup and then of course you already know when you're at a fall festival what do you do at the end you get a pumpkin so i had to get <laughs> create an area where you can grab your pumpkin um and then i wanted to leave these areas open so you guys can see like i can still access the rocks i like to show you guys that that leads to my forest of valor so i like to show you guys that i can still access certain things um and they're not completely blocked they just may either look blocked or they might be a little bit harder to get to and so i'm showing you over here near the water tower that um, you can still access the rock if you need to mine your plaza for any quests or anything um, again, I use the same path. Uh, I use the same path I used in my last build because I love it as a sidewalk. I'm just obsessed with that path, as you guys can tell. It just looks the most like a sidewalk to me, which fits the vibe. So then I'll be here. Um, again, you guys can access first. You can also still go into Woody's house and then you can also access the rock as usual. Put some grass, some stone. I really didn't know what to do on this side over here. So I just put some grass, made it look a little overgrown and put some rocks. This is a custom rug um, that I created from a build in another video months back. Um, the cottage build. So if you want to go back and check how I did that, you can check out my cottage build this cute little area i had to fill in um came out better than expected i love having the little clock there i was going to use the clock tower but it was they're so big and it takes up way too much space um and then this is like the little food court so i hope you guys liked it this is the little like food court area where you can come and grab a pretzel or a drink or a beverage i kind of use fairy godmother's house as kind of like a to fit the vibe of the decor but also like a little restaurant food court area like it's cute right so i put that there and then woody's carousel also fits in um, because mm, a lot of the festivals and places that i go to when it caters to kids and there's always like a carousel always so i had to put that there too um i kept accidentally talking to that squirrel when i was trying to pick up the <laughs> the sticks sorry as you'll see here um but yeah so that was my little food court area so i hope you guys enjoyed this build please let me know again what was your favorite part thank you guys so much for the love and support always please thumbs up this video um it really really helps and subscribe so you guys can see my next video whenever that is <laughs> love you guys so much and happy building dreamers